Hi, this is Mike from 5th Base Fiverr. In this video, I'm going to cover five pluses for a motorhome. Number one. Those limited on free time may want to think about a motorhome. For example, somebody working nine to five has two weeks vacation, maybe three. They have weekends, some of which are long. If they want to go, 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 five national parks in two weeks, rent a Class C motorhome. Try it out before they buy. There's plenty of rental opportunities. Tailgating, ideal for a motorhome. Have your fridge, have your bathroom, even air conditioning. Enjoy the pregame festivities with your friends. Too tired to go home? Sleep it off. Long weekends offer plenty of events, fireworks, concerts, film festivals, car races, boat shows, RV shows. The list goes on. For example, the 12 Hours of Sebring, which is a event in Florida in March. My wife and I would go, we parked the RV and walked to all the festivities for the weekend. Between the vendors and your RV, you've got it all right there. No excuses to leave the venue. Walk out to the event, back home on your time schedule. Want to go back out? Go back out. Take a nap, whatever. No toad needed. That's the little car pulled behind the motorhome by the full timers. If you like to zoom, 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 think about a motorhome. Number two, motorhome offers a great deal of space for family traveling. Some gangs are big, not this big. Some gangs are small, count off. Nevertheless, they have the run of the house while you're driving down the road. Number three, only one vehicle to back into a campsite. No trailer backing experience needed. Number four, security when boondocking like in the woods. Know that you can get to the driver's seat without leaving the house. Number five, bragging rights. It's hard to beat the luxury you can find in a motorhome. Don't worry about the Joneses when you drive into the park with your Prevost. Well, that's it. Go slow and you'll stay on the road.